Now that you've successfully hooked your Cubol Plus up to the speaker or sound system in your classroom, we're going to show you how to connect it to your computer and use it for online applications like Zoom and Google Meet. If you're still having issues connecting to your speakers, please refer to the setup instructions included with the Cubol Plus or visit the I Need Help section on our website. The first step is to take the USB cable connected to the Cubol Plus receiver, unplug it from the wall charger, and connect it to a USB port on your computer, if you haven't already done so. Now that you've connected the Cubol Plus receiver to your Mac, we'll need to go into the sound settings and select it as your default microphone. First, you're going to go to System Preferences, and then you're going to go to the Sound Settings, and here is where you can select both the output and the input device. So for input device, you're going to select the cue ball, which is listed as audio win USB. And then you're going to go ahead and do the same thing for the output. Doing this will ensure that the cue ball is your primary microphone and that any sounds playing on your computer will pass through the cue ball plus receiver to your speakers or sound system. You're now free to use Skype, Zoom, Google Meet, or any other recording or transcription software, and the cue ball will be the default microphone. If you have any other issues or problems, you can reach out to us directly at support at peak.us. That's support at p-e-q dot u-s.